two variables inverse. Five robots can produce a given amount of chairs in 16 days. How many robots can produce the same given amount of chairs in 40 days? Put into a table form, we're talking about robots and days. Robots and days. First, five robots, 16 days. In the second sentence, we are using 40 days, so under days we have 40, but we don't know how many robots. Let's make sense, why is it inverse? More days means less robots to complete given way because if you have more robots, you will spend less days. So if you are spending more days, means you don't have enough robots. So the number of robots and days are also inversely related. So you know that this is inverse proportion. Always start from with the variable x. So the first one is x over 5. Indirect or inverse means opposite way. So if you're going up, for days, you should be going what? Down. So that will be equal to 16 over 40. Be careful with this. Don't make it 40 over 16. Indirect is up and down. So it's, this one is indirect, sorry. So that's the only difference. Always start with the letter going up. Fine. It doesn't matter that way. But your second one needs to be very... Uh, should comply with whether it's direct or indirect. Then from here... You multiply both sides by 5 and you work out x. So when you work out x, you have 80 divided by 40, and that is 2 robots. And let's see if it makes sense. We had 5 robots working, so we worked for 16 days. We had only 2 robots working, which means they've got to do more for the, for the other 5. Therefore, we need what? More days. And it makes sense, 40. So always check your answer to see if it makes sense.